Hello everyone, today we will make uh, reverse osmosis membrane installation. Our system is 500 liter per hour and then now we see how we can do it. Hello, welcome to Guangzhou Chang'e Environmental Technology Company. Today we will teach to you how to change uh, your reverse osmosis uh, membrane in a system. Uh, first of all, I want, I want to introduce to you what kind of tools you need. First, we need a uh, silicone-based uh, lubricant. Uh, this kind of lubricant in your, you can find your country is very easy, uh, such as uh, the DuPont Molycote 111 is, uh, can be a good option for you. To open the nuts and uh, secret, we are using a key. And then to apply the lubricant to membrane uh, seal and then some special places, we are using a brush. And for safety, and we are using a plastic gloves. And then for also for eye safety, we are using glasses. And then for the cleaning uh, purpose, we are using uh, some cleaning cloths. Okay, now, uh, first of all, uh, I would like to talk about the direction of the membrane, how we install inside, and then how we can decide which direction we will put the membrane. Because this is very important, if we put the membrane in uh, wrong di direction uh, we damage our membrane and maybe we cannot use it again therefore when you are installing the membrane first you have to be sure about the direction how we can understand this one uh, this one is very easy to understand we can you we can thinking uh, something like this the machine is uh, the our raw water is coming from by high pressure to a membrane therefore high pressure pump to first membrane housing our first membrane and then uh, every membrane has a direction on uh, on it uh, now in in my hand there is one Vontron membrane this is ULP uh, 4040 type membrane and then you see the uh, direction is here uh, most of the membrane uh, supplier uh, put this direction on the uh, membrane but uh, but so, some of them maybe know how we can understand we are using correct direction. For this one also, we have other method. Uh, every membrane has a seal, this black one, uh, and then the other side, there is no seal. So it means that the, the water is, must go first to the sea, so uh, water must be go first to uh, seal side. So here our flow direction is from here to up, go up. Now uh, we will open our mem membrane and then I want to show to you uh, direction. Okay. This is the, our membrane. And this, this, this one to show the direction. Now we are first using our key to open the, our nuts uh, for the end cabbing. Here we are using a clamp to fix the membrane end, end cap. Now uh, we remove the uh, clamp uh, from the end cap and membrane housing and now we can remove our uh, end capping from uh, membrane housing. Is okay. Now we are using uh, our uh, silicone based lubricant to seal, seal side. Uh, 
and also we are using same to the membrane inlet and outlet now our membrane is ready to install okay now tell again the here is the direction is very important every membrane housing has a direction uh, this it means the water is coming uh, from uh, here the bottom the black seal side and then going up so when when you are installing the membrane you have to take care of this one when we are putting the membrane in membrane housing very slowly we don't need to uh, in a hurry, we, we use our hand as a guide to send membrane in inside. Okay, now we install the first membrane. Now we make the same procedure for the second one. Now we again uh, we use lubricant, uh, but th th this time is important the direction again because our water is coming from here and then now go to sec second membrane therefore the direction is uh, that side the water is go, go always first the black uh, seal side don't, we don't forget this one Now we install two membranes in the membrane housing. Now we will close the end cap. Uh, also, uh, before uh, before closing end cap, also we have to uh, use lubricant uh, to here. Now, now I am closing the end cap. Now installing of the membrane is finished. We firmly close the uh, end cap by screw uh, and uh, nut. And then uh, therefore when you test the machine, you have to check any, there, is there any leakage from the, this side. If there is a leakage, you can make more film. Uh, and then now it's finished. But I have to tell to you something about uh, before installation of the membrane. Uh, you have, for the safety, you have to be sure or electrical connection is closed up and also you have to check uh, for the pressure gauge and uh, flow meter uh, there is zero flow in the flow meter side and then there is no any pressure in pressure gauge side you have to be sure